Hello. They say that the one thing you're supposed to not do after you take a break from doing something is mention that you took a break from doing something, so... I already broke that rule. It wasn't even really a break. I am not gonna explain this. <laughs> not to mention the only rules that I'm following in 2017 are from Dua Lipa. So. Today I was rummaging through some old things when I found... This. I will admit, it was not in this adorable box when I found it, but you know, props are cute set design, folks. Budget. Going to the movies, for me, has always just been one of my favorite things. I love seeing new films, and I just love the experience of going to the theater, and also I just love that popcorn so damn much. I get it every time. Rule number four, don't judge me. So here I have, I would say at least a hundred, if not a couple hundred, movie tickets from when I was a teenager. I haven't looked through these in forever, so I'm excited to look through today with you. Let's just treat it like a game and... On August 8th, 2012, at 11.35 p.m., I saw Total Recall. And it's rated PG-13. I don't, honest, I have no idea. What is Total Recall again? Why are you here? Oh, oh, why? No, please! Well, it has 30% on Rotten Tomatoes, so it's obviously a classic. Okay, hopefully one that gets above 50%. On June 5th, 2010, I saw Killers, again, don't remember it, at 7.35 p.m. Solid time. 2010? Seven and a half years ago? What's Killers? Bonjour. <laughs> this one has 10% on Rotten Tomatoes. Oh my god, uh, my movie tastes, I would hope, have changed. <laughs> okay, uh, this one. Easy A! Oh my god! Rats. Hey, I want my juicy sweatshirt back! You switch you lose it on your chest anyway! Ooh, burn! On September 25th, 2010, at 5.30 p.m., my life was changed forever. Easy oh my god, this is a solid find. Easy A is one of my first introductions to Emma Stone as an actress. I used to say, this is funny, I used to say for the longest time that Emma Stone was my celebrity crush, and I mean, I, there's no lies in that, but that was also just, you know, a cover-up for the gay. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, well, we're one out of three. <laughs> eh. This, is, this one's up for debate. On November 23rd, 2011, at 4 p.m., I saw Breaking Dawn, part one. I think a lot of people are gonna judge me for this, but I may have seen all of the Twilight series in theaters, and I may have read the entire book series. Happy you were gonna judge me, happy you were gonna love me. I honestly enjoyed it so much. This is also just, you know, radiating the gay. What is going on? I'm like itching. My body is reacting to the cringe. <laughs> Fate. Let's go with ooh, a blue one. On November 19th, 2010, at 12.01 a.m. Ooh, risque. What did I see? What is the name of this film? Good Only On? Good, what? what? It's, it's torn. I can't even see it. That's a disappointment. Mm, Ta-da. This is just testing my knowledge of dates because I'm like, January, February, March, April, May, June, July. <laughs> I still have to do that. That's horrible. On May 22nd, 2010, at 1.15 p.m., my favorite time to see a movie, I saw Robin Hood. That's a fine film, but nothing will ever beat out the cartoon version. The cartoon version is classic. And this and that and having such a good time. Oodle lolly, oodle lolly, golly, what a day. Also, I'd like to mention that I saw this film for $6.50 at a normal theater. The last movie I saw in Los Angeles cost $17. What the fuck? G.I. Joe. Oh my god. Lovely Bones. I think that was a good movie. Wasn't that like a really popular book, The Lovely Bones? I think I liked that movie. Oh boy, that one has 31% on Rotten Tomatoes. What the heck? I feel like I remember I liked that one. The internet telling me different. <sighs> December 18th, 2010. Apparently this, these are just from like 2010. I saw the movie Tourist. Tourist? Tour? Touring. Tour? Touring? Tourist? Tour. 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 I'm just gonna guess that that one also got 30%. Come on, better choices. I saw Toy Story 2. 2? 2D? Toy Story 2D. Story 2010. Oh, it was Toy Story 3, okay. <gasps> Should we be hysterical? Now, yes, maybe, but not right now. Come on, let's see how much we're going for in eBay. 
Okay, so I saw Toy Story on June 23rd, 2010 at 1 p.m. And June 23rd, or right around June 23rd, 2010, was the time that I got my wisdom teeth out, I think. Pretty sure I went to Toy Story 3 and I cried extra hard because I was hyped up on drugs. <laughs> my emotions were running wild and my mouth was literally bleeding. I remember how livid I was I couldn't eat the popcorn. Oh my god, riveting. I love a Tuesday. Yeah. On October 22nd, 2011, for $7 at 10 p.m., I saw Paranormal Activity 3. I guarantee that's got like 6% on Rotten Tomatoes, but I love the paranormal movies. I think they're very spooky, very believable. We're getting out of here. Just get in the car and drive. <laughs> I remember when I went to the first Paranormal, my friends were convinced, not trying to convince me, they were convinced that it was a real movie. They were convinced it was a documentary, that this was like a real thing that was happening. And I'm like, um, one, people are dead, Karen. Two, no. Sit down, Karen. Why not one more? Because who cares? We love surprises. No. Why not an extra one? Because the last one sucked. That's two. One more, come on, you can do it, Connor. That was another Twilight film, oh my god. Okay, yep, we're done. Well, that was solid. <laughs> my movie tastes have clearly changed. Mostly Rotten Tomatoes just runs my life. Movies above 70%, great. Movies between like 70 and 30, wouldn't recommend it. Movies below 30, highly recommend. I almost recommend going to movies that are below 30% as much as I recommend going to movies that are above 70%. It's the, they're so shitty, they're good theory by me. Add it to my Wikipedia page, Karen. Well guys, that's just about it. Leave it in the comments down below. What are some of your favorite movies? If you're new here, make sure to subscribe. I make new videos every so often. Let's not talk about it. If you're returning, click the like button. I love charity. Other than that, I think I'm gonna go. I love you guys. I'll see you guys very, very soon. I promise. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to big thumbs up, leave a comment below. You're far away this week. Bye!